In question 8, we're told a curve has equation y is equal to 2x squared minus x minus 1 and a line has equation y is equal to k multiplied by 2x minus 3 where k is a constant. In part A for one mark, we need to show that the x coordinate of any point of intersection of the curve and the line satisfies the equation 2x squared minus the quantity 2k plus 1x plus 3k minus 1 is equal to 0. If y is equal to 2x squared minus x minus 1 and y is equal to k multiplied by 2x minus 3, we can set those equal. So we can say that 2x squared minus x minus 1 will be equal to k multiplied by 2x minus 3. I'm just going to expand the brackets on the right hand side. 2x squared minus x minus 1 is equal to 2kx minus 3k. I'm going to subtract 2kx from both sides and add 3k to both sides of the equation. So I'll have 2x squared, I'm going to have minus 2kx minus x, then I'm going to add the 3k plus 3k minus 1 is equal to 0. We can factor out the terms in x, so we'll have 2x squared, taking out the negative, we're going to have now negative the quantity 2k plus 1 multiplied by x plus the 3k minus 1 is equal to 0 as required. In part b it says the curve and the line intersect at two distinct points. In the first part for three marks we need to show that 4k squared minus 20k plus 9 is greater than 0. We can state the discriminant b squared minus 4ac will be greater than 0 for distinct roots. So for distinct real roots we can state the discriminant will be more than 0. So all I'm going to do is write this in and we have a quadratic equation in the form ax squared plus bx plus c is equal to 0. So let's go ahead and identify a, b and c. A is going to be 2, B is going to be minus the quantity 2k plus 1, and C is going to be 3k minus 1. So what I'm going to do here is B squared minus 4ac. So I'm going to have now minus 1 squared, then I'll have 2k plus 1 squared, that's B squared. If you like, you can just say minus 1 squared or just give us positive 1 minus 4 lots of a, which is 2, multiplied by c, which is 3k minus 1, and that will be greater than 0. So all I've done is use the discriminant. So this is going to now, if I expand this, this will be 4k squared, then we're going to have now plus 2k, plus another 2k, and then we're going to get plus 1. If I expand this, we've got 8 and then we got 3, so that will be minus 24k, and then we're going to have now plus 8 is greater than 0. So let's tidy up our quadratic in k. We have 4k squared. We've got plus 2k plus 2k minus 24k, which is going to be minus 20k, and then we got plus 1 and plus 8, that's going to be plus 9, and that's greater than 0 as required. So all I've done is found the values of a, b and c, used the discriminant and stated that b squared minus 4ac will be greater than 0 for distinct real roots. OK, in the second part for 4 marks, we need to find the possible values of k. So what we're looking at now is a quadratic inequality. It looks like I can factor that. So if I factor that, I'm going to have 2k minus 1 multiplied by 2k minus 9 and that will be strictly greater than 0. So let's just check 4k squared minus 18k minus 2k plus 9. So let's go ahead and look at our critical values. We can see our critical values will have 1 half and we'll have 9 over 2. I'm going to draw a quick sketch. We certainly don't need one but it might help you out now looking for the values that satisfy this inequality, or if you like, the possible values of k. So just uh, sketching a quick parabola, we're going to have one half here and we'll have nine over two. Our parabola looks something like this. 
we're interested in this now when it's going to be greater than zero. This is where we have zero. And we can see that it's above the line here. And this is one half. And then it's going to be above the line just here, which is nine over two. So we can say now that k will be less than one half. And we'll also have k greater than nine over two. So these now are the values that satisfy the inequality, or if you like, the possible values of k. Four marks in total, k is less than one half, or k is greater than nine over two.